such. You are a great marketer. I love it. We we're talking about that off camera. And we also want to remind everybody that the game and the atmosphere goes beyond the X's and O's and people watching the matchup on the field. Even if you're not a soccer fan, you can really feel the energy at the game just by coming on out there, banging the drums and cheering. And now they're taking it to a new level. Why is that? The El Paso Locomotive FC, they have just hired Johnny Cage. Johnny Cage is a popular DJ right here in El Paso. He's been DJing in this scene, not only in El Paso, but uh, Ciudad Juarez as well, for over 20 years, and he has certainly taken it to the next level, not only spinning on the ones and twos at all of these games, but also he is the new public address announcer, and here he is. Check it out. This is Johnny Cage mixing it up at an El Paso Locomotive FC game. Getting the fans pumped up at all the matchups, not only through music, but also as the public address announcer. Who's ready for the soccer? Who's ready? Johnny Cage already made a name for himself here on the 915 as the host of the highly rated Morning Mash radio show on 104.3 Hit FM. And now this. It's super awesome just seeing, uh, you know, El Paso has a great fan base, especially for, for soccer. It means a lot to me just to get these these uh, these fans pumped up and just ready to rock. I mean, the team, uh, they, they get pumped up with all the, uh, the noise, so we like to get it loud in here. He's also known worldwide as a resident DJ for Pitbull's Globalization Radio and Sirius XM Channel 13. Johnny Cage has been a staple in the El Paso radio scene for over 20 years and has won scores of awards for his work on the ones and twos. Talk about how you add to that experience through your DJ. I do a lot of stuff for the Sumble Association uh, during the Tony the Tiger Sumble and just by chance one of uh, one of their members uh, saw me doing my thing and they're like hey this would be great for the uh, locomotives and I said I've been waiting I've been waiting I've been waiting I'm waiting for the locomotives I'm waiting for the chihuahuas let's do this let's make a let's make a big old party a poodle party as I call it. Poodle party with the fans in the stands going bananas. Getting the crowd crazed straight local style. As in El Paso locals. With Locomotive FC continuing to make its mark here in the Borderland community. Slow, go, slow, go. And of course, Johnny Cage, he also continues to get involved with the community. He DJs all around town, but it's very popular to see him at certain places around town with all the charities, so it's great. And Johnny told me off camera that obviously he loves and he gets a great satisfaction helping others out. So props to him. And of course, this is almost like a dream opportunity for him as well because he loves uh, supporting all the local causes and of course, local sports as well. You know, the, the doors opened at six here at Southwest <laughs> University Park. Let's get right to ABC7 sports reporter B. Martinez talking to some of the fans who are making their way into the stadium. B. Hey, B. 